Hello YouTube, this is Jason. Sorry, it's been a long time since so far I've made a video. Um, I haven't really had anything to talk about, to be honest with you. Um, I haven't really got anything to talk about tonight, to be honest. But I feel it's been it's been nearly a year now since I, I last really had any uh, communication with my mum and dad, um, and I really miss them. I really miss them. Um, I know a lot of people are angry towards. Jehovah's Witnesses for the way they treat their family members um, and the way they abandon them um, when they choose to not follow their religion. Um, I don't blame them at all, um, and because and that's because I know the power that that Watchtower organisation has on the people, um, and it's not them that I blame. It's the ones that are teaching the kind of nonsense that they do, like the issue of disfellowshipping. Shunning is something that is not scriptural. It's something that only um, that has only been created in order to try and keep people keep people within the organisation and stop them from finding out the real truth about Jesus. If you are watching this YouTube channel, Mum and Dad, uh, I haven't made it um, to try and uh, discourage people from their faith. That's not what I've tried to do. But I believe what the Watchtower organisation has done to you in terms of splitting up our family um, is something that is borderline on evil. And um, the scripture, which I actually, uh, it was the snarky apology. If there's no one watched, has watched this channel, he's got an exceptional channel. And um, Bill, your, some of your videos have really helped me um, during my time coming to Christ. And uh, this scripture, just to reiterate uh, the one that he put on his video, Ephesians five, Ephesians chapter five, verse ten. Carefully determine what pleases the Lord. Now, do you think by abandoning your own family members that's something that's pleasing to the Lord? Because I don't, I don't think so. When you look at how Jesus lived his life. Take no part in worthless deeds of evil and darkness. And that's the reason I will not turn, return to the Watchtower organisation. And then it says, instead expose them. Any person, I think, for the majority of people who, who come onto YouTube and make these kind of videos, they do it because they want to expose... The, the, the falsehood that is the uh, Watchtower and Bible and Tract Society, and that's all I'm trying to do as well. Um, as you can see, I, I, I've, I wanted to um, do a song for them. Um, I, I, I want to do a song for my mum and dad, because I dearly miss them, and I really hope and pray that one day we can be a family again. Um, and I actually wrote this song, strangely, when I was disfellowshipped as a witness and I was trying to get back in and trying to be reinstated um, little did I know that um, that through all that time of pain and darkness actually Jesus was there waiting for me um, and gave me the hand that I needed and he didn't pull me back into the organisation instead he pulled me to Christ and um, that's what happened um, but anyway, I want to uh, write, do this song and dedicate it to them. Um, however, um, the, my microphone does tend to uh, get quite loud, so I'm going to back off and then play the song. So, uh, Mum and Dad, this is for you. And this is called Finding a Way Back to You. On this very special day When you think what has been One of the toughest years you've seen I should have listened to you Cause now I'm stuck in a stew And I just need to find a way back to you Cause I'm lost without your love I just need to find a way back to you Cause without you I feel lost And all I can say is this I love you guys more than anything in the world I know it's not gonna be long 
I heard the expression, throw your burden on Jehovah. If you're watching this as one of Jehovah's Witnesses and you're struggling because your burden is your religion, throw it on to Jehovah and the only thing he will lead you to is happiness and to Christ Jesus. Peace be with you. <laughs> 